Hi, I'm Chris, and this is Lin Focus, where we take a look at some of the big changes coming to Limworks this month. In this focus, we've got some new open order features, a rundown on Shopify POS, and some new eBay policy stuff. Let's get started. Last week, we released the new open order screen into public beta. That means anyone can check it out and start using it without an invitation. You can get to the screen by clicking the open orders that has a big red beta sign next to it, which means you'll be able to use both versions of the screen in parallel while we work out the kinks. Welcome to the public beta test for the new open order screen. I'm Chris, and I'm going to explain how the beta works and what you can do to help us test this new feature. If you want to share your thoughts on the new screen, click the loudspeaker button at the top of Limworks to leave feedback. Alongside the new screen comes support for custom order identifiers. If you go to Settings, General Settings, and open the Order Settings tab, you'll be able to create your own custom order tags on the bottom right. Give your tag a name and even upload an image. The identifier will then appear on any order you assign it to. Right now, you can only assign a custom identifier using the Rules Engine, but you'll be able to manually add them soon too. For anyone with a retail store and a Shopify site, you'll be pleased to hear that Limworks now supports Shopify point of sale. How you enable Shopify POS will depend on your settings. If your POS orders are marked as shipped on Shopify, then check the download processed orders option. If they're left unshipped, then check the process POS orders option. You can also specify which Limworks location these orders download to in the order download location settings to make sure POS stock is deducted from the right warehouse. Now you can keep track of all your Shopify orders, both web and retail, all in one place. In eBay news, they're tightening their policy on item location. The item location misrepresentation policy is a bit of a mouthful, but basically it just means you need to make sure the location where the item is being shipped from is displayed accurately on your listing. So if you're shipping from China, just say it's from China to keep eBay and your buyers happy. I'll throw a link in the description for more details. And finally, I'd like to thank everyone that came to our latest growth meetup in Manchester on the 9th. We had a great turnout and everyone learned a lot about SEO best practices and marketplace marketing. Follow us on socials to hear news about more growth meetups we're planning for the future. I'll also drop a link to our events page in the description. And that's it for Lim Focus this month. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in May.